Hello everyone, this is Mamta Amund and today we are going to solve some exercise questions 1 to 14 of chapter uh, of exercise 1e of chapter 1. Chapter name is Knowing Our Numbers of class 6 of Composite Mathematics Textbook. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel then please subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the bell icon for getting notifications of future videos and please visit my blog maxgrade.com for more information regarding the textbook solutions of CBSE, ICSE and other state books. Let's get started and solve some questions. Today we will learn and solve exercise questions 1 to 14, exercise 1e, chapter name is Knowing Our Numbers and topic is Uses of Numbers in Everyday Life. Let's, let's solve some questions. Now question number 7. A garment factory sold goods worth 8,23,566 rupees in the month of March. The sale proceeds for the first two weeks were 2,03,456 and 1,93,234. What were the sale proceeds for the of the last two weeks? So it is given that the garment factory sold this amount that is 8 this quantity of cloth sold in the month of March is 8,23,506 rupees this uh, this amount that is 8,23,506 rupees sold in the month of March the sale proceed for the first week in the first two weeks the sale, uh, sale was 2,3,456 and first two weeks. First and second week it is 1,93,234. What were the sale proceeds for the last two weeks? That is we have to find out the last three, uh, last two weeks. That is uh, week three, third week and fourth week. What were the sale? What uh, amount was, uh, what amount the sale? In the last two weeks, that is uh, week number three and week number four, third week and fourth week, what amount they sell? In, we have to find out the amount that sell proceed for the last two weeks. Last two weeks. So first add these two numbers. That if in the first two weeks, sell in first two week, first two weeks is. 2,3,456 and 1,93,234 Add these two numbers 6 plus 4 is 10 carry over 1 1 plus 5 is 6 6 plus 3 is 9 then 4 plus 2 is 6 Now add this number 3 plus 3 is 6 0 plus 9 is 9 2 plus 1 is 3 3 lakh 96,690 rupees so the total sale in first two weeks is 3,96,690 rupees. Now find out the, the sale for the last two weeks. That is total. Total amount is 8,23,566 rupees minus this amount. 3,96,000. That is eight lakh eight lakh twenty three thousand five hundred six five hundred six minus this amount three lakh ninety six thousand six hundred ninety. Now we have to subtract this 
rupees that is 396690 rupees from this amount that is 823506 now 6 minus 0 is 6 then we can't uh, subtract 9 from 0 so we have to take the carry over now this is 10 10 minus 9 is 1 now here 5 changes to 4 4 minus 6 we can't subtract so here carry over this 5 this 4 now this is 14 And this fourteen minus six is eight. Fourteen minus six is eight. And here, this three changes to two. Two minus six we can't subtract. Two minus six. Now we have to carry over this. Twelve minus six is six. Now here one. Two two changes to one. One minus nine we can't subtract. So take the carry over eleven. Eleven minus eleven. Eleven minus nine is two. Now we are eight changes to seven. Seven minus three is four. This is the amount. So the so the total sale for the last two weeks is four four lakh twenty six thousand eight hundred sixteen rupees. Four lakh twenty six thousand eight hundred sixteen rupees is the sale for the last two weeks. Now question number eight. A milk depot sells. Six hundred fifty-seven liters of milk every day. In each day, the milk seller sells six hundred fifty-seven liters of milk. How much milk will it sell in one year? And one year has three hundred sixty-five days. So in one day, milk sell is one day milk sell. Selling milk is 657 liters. So 365 days. We have to multiply 365 multiplied with 657 liters. Now 5 7 times 35 3. Five five is twenty five plus three twenty eight. This is two. Then five six is thirty. Thirty plus two thirty two. Now six seven is twenty forty two four. Then six five is thirty. Thirty plus four is thirty four. This is three. Now six six is thirty six plus three is thirty nine. Now three seven is twenty one. This is two. Three five is fifteen plus two is Seventeen. Now three six is eighteen plus one is nineteen. Now this is five. Here five. Eight plus two is ten. One two plus one three three plus four seven seven plus one eight. Three plus nine twelve twelve plus seven is nineteen. One three plus one four four plus nine thirteen. One plus one two. Two lakh thirty-nine thousand eight hundred five. So two lakh thirty-nine thousand eight hundred five. This amount of um, this is liter. This is liter. So two lakh uh, <coughs> in the milk depot sell in one year. Two lakh, <coughs> two lakh thirty nine thousand eight hundred five liters of milk. So two lakh thirty nine thousand eight hundred five liters of milk, the milk depot sells in one year. If you want to learn more about that Vedic math multiplication, you can calculate this multiplication using the Vedic math uh, sutra that is vertically and crosswise. If you want to learn that <coughs> how to multiply. Subtract addition using the Vedic Math Sutra. Then I will give the link in the description box. Please watch that video. Okay, if you want to learn more about that Vedic Math multiplication, addition, subtraction, how to multiply, how to add the numbers using Vedic Math Sutra, that is the uh, vertical crosswise sutra and all uh, all from nine and last from ten. If you want to learn this. That sutra, how to multiply, how to subtract. Then I will give the link in the description box.
for now subscribe my youtube channel then please subscribe my youtube channel and if you have any doubts then please write in comment section and i will reply keep learning keep watching and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you